we tried out a VIP package at the Red Bull Arena, home of the New York Red Bulls, and here's how we got on. I arrived at the stadium a few hours before kickoff, and there was a really good atmosphere outside with a load of games and competitions going on. Didn't fancy showing up any of the Americans with my football skills, so instead I head over to the Wendy stand to spin for a prize. Quite a few different stands where you could win prizes, and in the end I settled on one of these flashlights. And this one was a nice touch, a New York Red Bulls can call a sleeve. Having stocked up on the free prizes, I then made my way over to the VIP entrance. Phone and wallet down as I made my way through security. And as you're making your way through the VIP entrance, you then get your ticket scanned. Then make your way over to the reception where you receive a wristband on entry. And another nice touch was that you get a New York Red Bull scarf. There is lift and stairs access upstairs and into the VIP lounges. And we found this guy inside who was a big fan out of the lift, or should I say elevator, and into the Provident Bank Suite Lounge. A really smart but informal area which overlooks the pitch, but we made our way over to one of the many food stations. All of the food is freshly prepared and it's unlimited, so you can help yourself to as much as you like. And needless to say, I wanted to tuck into a bit of everything, including the sushi, and I may or may not have had a few portions of the peppercorn tomahawk steaks. Probably could have done with a bit more peppercorn sauce, but I'm not complaining. So I grabbed my plate and made my way over to a seat with a great view of the pitch. There is an open bar all afternoon with a lot of different drinks to choose from, but when you're in the New York Red Bull arena, there's only one choice. And as mentioned, there were loads of different food stations, so we had to give these hot dogs a try, which went down a treat. Speaking of treats, if you have a sweet tooth, then you're in luck because there are loads of desserts and sweet treats to choose from. This Oreo cheesecake being my favorite. 15 minutes before the match and it's a good idea to head back down to the VIP entrance where there is a window into the tunnel and you can watch the players lining up. Then once you're finished you make your way back upstairs and outside into the stand. My recommendation would be to get out here as quickly as you can as there's not much time between the players lining up and the start of the match. So a couple of minutes before kickoff we made our way down some steps and into the manager's box. And as the name of the area would suggest you get a pretty amazing view of the pitch as well as some equally amazing padded seats from where you can watch the match. And another nice touch was the in-seat food and drink service. Can't say I've ever watched a football match with popcorn, but I could definitely get used to it. As mentioned in the manager's box, you get unrivaled views of the pitch, but you can also see players before the match at halftime and full time coming on and off the pitch and going down the tunnel. VIP tickets inside the manager's box are from £365. And something else that was a nice touch, after the match we also received a free pin badge of a New York Red Bulls legend. Big thanks to New York Red Bulls for an amazing afternoon and some pretty awesome hospitality. Where should we go for the next padded seat?